Hello and welcome to another Forum and Liberty video. Today we're going to talk about the Battle Pass. So, you know, it's pretty normal now that all games in the world pretty much has a Battle Pass nowadays. And of course, Forum and Liberty has one as well. So shouldn't we go into it and see what it is? If you press Escape, you will find here in the very top, Battle Pass. It will first show like a pop-up because, you know, something that I don't understand and, you know, so I'm gonna like commercial for it. But basically this is the battle pass. I'm just gonna hide my webcam for a second. So here you can see this is the battle pass. We have the free row. So this is the free pass. And if we uh, go all the way to the left, this is the free row, which is everyone is able to get from. And this is the pre premium one. So as you can see, each of the rows actually give like a lot of items you can use in the game. For example, here you get 50,000 Soland on the premium one. You get some quality recovery crystals. You know, all these items here, even these Stellarites, are like items you can find in the game. These even are like the magic powder that you would normally get from contracts, your daily work. These are the upgrade tokens, so like look at that, upgrade tokens, even from the free one. But if you have the paid version, you get even like 10 for your armor, which is really good. Another five for your items. And here you can see the free one gets almost nothing, two, 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 but the paid one gets 10, 10, 10. So it could definitely, you know, I'm definitely getting the, the premium one on when the, this game actually releases in Europe. And then you can see just a lot of nice materials, 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 like, you know, just a lot of nice materials. And even the premium all has like epic upgrades. And then at the end, um, the free one is getting 50,000 solar and the premium one is getting a costume. So basically this one here, Spirit Pool Warrior. So pretty cool. And you can see it's basically the one that she has on, um, on the costume here. Like this costume she has on here is the one you get here. You can also go back here and see, you know, the old battle passes. So this was the first one where again, you could see you could get the costume that this person has on. And the next one here, again, the costume that the person has on in the picture. And the third one now, which we have here. You cannot progress in any of the old. You could claim the reward you had forgotten to claim, but you cannot like do this one again. You can see the battle passes over, you don't have task this progress. So basically, Boohoo, it's over, utilate. And this one here is also, I only did like, I think I did to level 35 almost, and then it ended. So basically it. But then we have the new one here, which uh, I'm currently almost 20. Basically how to increase your battle pass is by here on the right side, you have things you can do daily, you have things you can do weekly, and things you can do always and premium so basically there is some tasks that only premium is going to get from for example premium is getting from just locking in so every, every day you log in i assume you get this one here you can see i have quite a lot of that i could probably redeem this quite a lot of times complete resistance contract use world tree leaves for health recovery send contract coins spend solent but I'm not able to get this one. Then you have to always one, spend contract coins. And basically you can see, I can click on it twi twice, but you can see all this here is stuff that you can do to actually get these rewards. For example, here, lock in 14 out of 20. So in six days, I assume, I, I don't think it's just like locking in and locking out, that would be weird. But yeah, we also have weekly. So things you could do weekly, well, uh, yeah, so you can see the first week you can do these, second week you can do these, third week you can do these, and I guess week four you can do these. But this is like, it unlocks every week because I guess every battle pass is only like four weeks since they only have four weeks up here. But uh, let's see, we, we got something here I can redeem. Um, daily we have complete resistance contracts. And you know, because I have con completed a lot of contracts, we can just keep clicking, clicking, clicking. There we go, defeat monsters. And again, I can keep clicking because it's every time you like it. Get it. Use wall tree leaves to health recovery. Yep. Spend contract coins. Yep. There we go. So now I just redeemed all my points. I could probably doing all these things. You can see I have already done these now. So what I could today is lock in from a PC room. It's kind of like some kind of like special network. You have to sit in like on a, like a, a net cafe, if you know what I mean. The solve common or higher equipment. So basically I have to destroy uh, common or higher equipment. 
to get out the materials. Uh, but now you can see I can get these, our rental coin chest, training books, training books, or grip materials, claim all rewards. So yeah, so basically the battle pass in uh, this game here gives you items to upgrade, gives you a pet, as you can see, a pet. This is one of those you can have a run. They follow you and basically loot for you. And then you can get a costume. The, the other one also has a pet here. It actually did. Uh, morphs don't contain the power of the wild. No, wait, that's morphing, so you turn into the pit. Oh, yeah, there. A pet and a costume. Uh, pet and a costume. And it even has... Oh, it even has more pets. And this one also has a morph stone, so you can, like, turn into, like, another animal. Another animal here as well. And do we have any animals here? Yeah, some kind of like bird. And if you wanted the premium one, you would have to buy it here, as you can see, for this currency. So whenever it releases in Europe or NA, it will probably say something like 10 or 20 dollars or euro or euros. So again, this is just the currency they're using in Korea. And this would, of course, be the currency they use in uh, Europe or USA when it comes out. So that's pretty much the battle pass. Like, you know, you can also buy here additional points. So like, just like any other MMO where you can like buy additional points to upgrade. So you can see I can buy points to get up in levels, but it's getting quite uh, expensive. You can, it, it's, it's actually pretty cool. You use the currency called the cent, which is a currency you can both buy for money, but you can also get it from just selling stuff in auction house. So you could theoretically sell a lot of items on auction house and also just buy these points. You also have this star shop here, which I am not 100% sure what it's about. It's some kind of like star crystals you need to use to get these uh, poses and items. But where you get those star crystals from is, is it from to the premium row? I don't know. Do know. Don't know. Well, again, that's not important. We, uh, we covered everything that is important here. So um, thanks for watching, everyone. This was uh, just a quick info video about the battle pass in this game. So as you can see, the battle pass is a nice little thing. It's not like something you need, uh, but of course it gives you some nice costumes. It gives you some nice upgrading tokens, which is going to help you in the game to get up like a bit faster. So nice and convenient in case you wanted. So yeah. Thanks for watching, have a great day, and um, I'll see you in another video. And if you want to watch me live stream Throne and Liberty on Twitch, you can find me on twitch.tv slash D-V-A-L-I-N Dvalin. And I am streaming Throne and Liberty every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday. We do also have a guild here called Grace Call Bros. So you can play with us. We do like every time I have those streaming days, Monday, Wednesday, and saturday we play together we do dungeons together you know we just do like fun stuff together so in case you want to have like a social guild to play with but thanks for watching have a great day peace out